Hi. I'm freaking tired, guys. It's like 2 a.m. But according to the specific coast time, it's 10:20. I can't do math right now. I'm sorry. So um, we are in Portland, Oregon. P, this is why people think I smoke. All right, we are in Portland, Oregon. Or I guess Vancouver, Washington. It's the same thing. Look it up. And it's uh, very late, so I'm very tired. But I'm forced against my will to make this video. <laughs> so I'm trying my best here, guys, but. It's too late for this. Um, I can't think, yo. All right. So Portland, Oregon has this place called Blue Star Donuts. And for you Eisenheimers out there who are going to tell me that voodoo's better, get a freaking clue and look it up because all the locals say that voodoo is for tourists only and it's overrated and Blue Star actually destroys it. So I don't want to hear any flack from all the smart Alex out there who are gonna be like, oh my God, why didn't you go to Voodoo? Because I didn't, because they say this is better. So you're gonna have to argue with the locals who came up with that idea. Because all the locals say that this is way better. So I don't wanna hear it from anybody about Voodoo, okay? Ouchie. I don't wanna, I'm, some guy's gonna be a smart Alex and be like, oh my God, he didn't go to Voodoo. I don't wanna hear it. Okay. People say this is way better. Do you understand me, guys? Let's eat. Alright. So this, oh, it smells delicious. Okay, so we got six donuts. $25 total. Yes, they're expensive. $4 a donut. Now, this first culinary delight here, with an exquisite palate, is your lemon poppy poppy seed donut yeah. um, I read a review about this and they said it's freaking delicious like this is one of the better ones so we will test the waters here um, how do you want to do this just bite it hmm, very lemony tastes like a freaking lemon in a donut very strong lemon flavor. That's very strong. You know why? I'm gonna show you right here. I don't know if you can see it. This top layer right here, this thin layer is uh, lemony delight. Not like a Turkish delight, because those are disgusting. <laughs> but this is very lemony delight. You know, it's kind of, uh, tastes like one of those lemon Girl Scout cookies, kind of. It's all right, I give it a seven. I mean, it's good for a donut. It's just, it's got a lot of lemon. You know what I'm saying? Are you about to have some more? No. <laughs> Calm Not down over there. One. Calm down over there. No. Okay, we'll put this one here. Five more to try. Oh, this is the main one that they're famous for. Blueberry basil. I swear, that's what it's called. Blueberry basil. Uh, purplish color color overtone to it you could also call that violet I don't know other names for purple but that's what we're calling it under here there's a more natural uh, I'm just saying stuff this is the main one though that they're famous for okay that's freaking weird <laughs> I don't even know what I'm tasting guys I don't know about that one, it's weird. I can smell the basil. I don't taste any blueberry. Oh, no, it's the aftertaste. Blueberry's the aftertaste. It hits you right at the end. Right when you're about to mail it in and give up on blueberry. It hits a very strong uh, blueberry aftertaste. Which I don't know how they do that. How do you not taste it right away, but you taste it afterward. I'm not crazy about the basil, but the blueberry is very nice. I like fruit. I like juice. Delicious. It's weird because you think it sucks at first and then it's, it hits you afterward and you're like, it's pretty good. No, it sucked the whole time. I give it a seven, just like the lemon. What do you think? She gives everything like a two, so 
It's like um, lip gloss at the end. The like little girl lip gloss. No, it's like not. Cinderella lip gloss. All right, I don't even know where to go with that. She doesn't even rate it. She's just like comes out with these insane claims. <laughs> Someone's like shoelaces. I'm like, what the hell does that mean? You don't even rate it. See, I always have to be like, yo, you're it's just supposed a one. to freaking. Well, you gotta say it. You can't just ramble on about some stuff. You like, it tastes like paint. It's like you gotta give it a rating. She's rambling. She doesn't give it a rating. One, one. She's not impressed. And with that's the only main. because it's a donut. She's not impressed with the main thing. You know, one thing I learned about Portland: all the food here. They try to come up with the craziest stuff ever. They take normal food and make it like super weird. Like today I ate something called a frit witch, which sounds like some swear word or something, but like it's like an apple fritter as the bun. And then there's like eggs and stuff and cheese and bacon on the inside. And your, your palate doesn't even know what to think because it's so random. And I feel like that's how Portland food is. Like it just, everybody tries to one up each other with some crazy stuff. Like in Tennessee, it's like eggs, bacon, chicken. Like we don't have this weird combinations. I mean, it's cool. I'm cool with it. The foods here are amazing. I'm not saying that. It's just very strange. That's my rant for the night. All right. This one's like uh, hot cocoa or something like Mexican that. Mexican hot cocoa. Mexican hot cocoa? Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, I didn't know we were getting <laughs> like that with it, but I'm not offended. It's cakey in my mouth. I can't even talk. It like sticks to your gums. Wow, that's a chewy one right there. You need the water for that one, guys, because that stuff just cakes in your mouth. Like, you, like, chokes you. Like, it's got a weird aftertaste, too. It's kind of funky. But aren't all of these funky? It's kind of good, but it's kind of funky. It tastes like I'm like coffee is like clammed down on my throat and I'm choking on coffee. That's sort of, feel, I'm not even making this up. It feels like I'm like choking on some coffee that's burned on my throat. I'm not making this sound very good. I don't like that one. It's, I'm getting this coffee thing right here. It won't go away. It's like my throat is on fire with coffee. I don't know how to make it. That's a four, it's weird. It's like glued to my throat. I'm serious, it's weird. Like I'm getting heartburn right now from that bite. Did you stop? I'm not making this up. This is how it freaking happens. What? Wait. Yeah, you're feeling it now too, heartburn. <laughs> it's spicy. That's what it is. It's like I'm, it's like my throat's on fire right now. Spices. I don't like that. Oh my gosh. Well, see, There's something in there. What are they doing in Portland? This is why they have legal weed here. This is what happens. <laughs> People are like making stuff up like in their freaking sinks at home. There's something in there, like pepper. 